Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the third game of the top eight for the Peach Cup. Uh, we have our <coughs> local maxi enthusiast, Ray the Thumb. Almost an apologist, I'm thinking about it. And our <laughs> as almost as tall as Usain Bolt sexy man, Luca. I think he's six okay. six now, right? Yep. We're six six. <laughs> yeah, <never> six. <laughs> <laughs> oh, very, very fun. All right, so uh, what game do we have today? We have Element Sabers versus, versus Starry Night, right? Yes, sir. All right, uh, you know, I, I really I really want Starry Night to win this, um, but I think Element Sabers might just, like, confuse our opponent to death. So. Yeah, the, the Element Saber deck is very, very confusing. But you know what? Um, yeah, you... You know, tour guide profile picture, yo, you gotta win, right? <laughs> average far from viewer experience. Yeah, Anyways. Our average far from viewer. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and get straight on into it. So we do see uh, Megami the Crimson Demon uh, winning yes. the the die roll, and mm -hmm. we've got uh, Megaman Natsu. Is that is that a JJK reference? I might be wrong. That is a, that is, I think so. Okay. Well, anyway, we see them winning the die roll. They are gonna go first, and we have uh, Starry Night going first. All right. Uh, so, for, for, for the first time, first play of the game will not be an activate extract. It will probably be. The next play will be. <laughs> yes, it will. All right, so we're setting Starry Night Arrival. <laughs> yep, yep. Oh, someone can have right? Yeah. Uh, so we set Starry Night Arrival. This just lets you cheat out the Starry Night Starry Dragon, which is, again, yes. a pretty strong card. Uh, if it's normal special mm -hmm. summon, target card in the field, destroy it. Can't be destroyed by a dark monster or a dark monster effect, uh, which... I guess kind of does matter against this this list because yeah. we did see they are main decking uh, a dark arm dragon, uh, and they mm -hmm. are playing said in the side deck. Uh, and then once mm -hmm. per turn to start damage step, this card attacks an opponent's monster. You can banish that opponent's monster until the end phase, and this card make it, can make a second attack. Uh, so this is this is kind of a it is a decent card, unironically. Yeah. Uh, but then we are going to summon Rael, Rael effect to add another Starry Night spell trap. We're going to add Ceremony. Ceremony uh, to reveal a Light Fairy in your hand if you do add a level 7 Light Dragon. So this is how you get to Yeah, but it also, uh, it, when your opponent activates an effect, it lets you summon. Uh, oh, yeah. Yeah, uh, it does. So it's, this is basically the Fluandri's Field spell for mm -hmm. for this deck. Uh, yes. I think we're going to activate Ties of the Brethren here. Yep. So we're going to activate Ties, target that, pay 2, mm -hmm. uh, summon the Barrier Statue. <laughs> okay, so this is how we get to it. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Sure. Damn. All right. <laughs> Uh, we're gonna yeah. make a all right. So we got uh, or beetle or beetle effect. Um, yeah, to set a trap. Uh, is that what it is? Where is it? Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah you target one like uh, and if you tribute it and if you do set a trap. Okay, so we're just gonna tribute itself. Set a starry night blast. Uh, when your opponent activates a card effect, return one level seven, uh, like dragon you control to the hand. Negate that effect, and if you do destroy that card, oh, they okay. So they've got berry statue. They got a negate up. They have a Flandre's field spell. They have a quick effect. Uh, they have a trap card that lets them either yeah. bounce or special the dragon, and they just got a rail on field. Yeah. All right. I mean, not gonna lie, that's kind of a board. It's that's that's kind of a board. board. It's, a, it's kind of a board. I mean, I'm with it. I mean, like, look at this. Mm -hmm. Like, we're not actually yeah. doing a whole lot. I think. I think this card right here will be the problem. Yeah, the card of destruction. Yeah. All right. We'll but, see if yeah. they. Uh, we'll see if they activate it. Yep. All right. So they add a uh, grand soil to hand. Yeah. And, like uh, you have a choice between card of destruction or pot. Yep, and they are activating the pot of extravagance. And they're choosing the pot, which yep. in hindsight is probably the right choice. All right, so they uh, pull a uh, loop, uh, a mana and a grace yeah. dorado. Okay. You are drawing your light monsters, which is good. Yep, all right. Foolish Burial. Foolish Burial for uh, Mikani. Uh, let's mm -hmm. see, what is, does this do anything when it's sent to Graveyard? Uh, uh, no, it's, but no, it does it lets you, you a, it, It's yeah. another attribute. Uh, yeah. All right. Uh, effect of mana to discard two to special itself. All right. Mm -hmm. uh, that is a light monster, so we're good. Uh, they activate ceremony, summon the dragon. Okay. And the dragon effect gets it. to pop the mana. They yeah. set the uh, card destruction and they mm -hmm. pass turn. All right. Well, this this might be a pretty quick one. Uh, summon the condemned witch, condemned witch effect to search any forbidden spell. They're going to get chalice to hand. Kind of nice. Um, the attack gain, I think. Yeah, probably. Uh, mm -hmm. They're gonna overlay for Utopia. Oh, they're going for Utopia double based. Oh, they're not even no, going for it. Just well, yeah, you, yeah, just yeah Utopia, Utopia double only works on monsters. Oh, it does. Yeah. That's right. Uh, so 25, 20, uh, 25, 25. Arrival. Arrival to summon way. another 25 and then 18 for game. Yeah. 
Yep. Sick. Uh, DB's lagging. Yep. But then that should just be lethal for them. Yeah. yeah. All right. Starting night two is game one. I hey, that was that was a board. Not gonna lie. That was kind of smooth. That was kind of sick. They were kind of slick with it. Not gonna lie. Yeah. Not gonna lie. All right. Well, let's go ahead and uh, as as Luca's cat is meowing furiously in the background, <laughs> we'll go ahead it, just, and... it, just, it just saw he Starry just Night, Starry Dragon, like be. No, he's he's just being a brat and wants attention. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, let's go ahead and get into the game too. All right, so uh, Element Sabers is going to go first. Uh, now the question is, will they activate the pot of extravagance? <laughs> the feeble pot of extravagance. All right, now God. currently we do see double or nothing drawn yeah. from the uh, Starry Night players. So that's pretty bad for them. It's because they're not uh, playing the common. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, yeah they're not playing the common. <laughs> All right, so we see an uh, Ina, Ina, and they got a Mallow. Hey, 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 that's my favorite card. They they got some uh -huh. they got some names. Uh, so they they grab the field spell. Uh -huh. I do remember the field spell being being. <laughs> let, instead of discarding, it lets you send from deck. So this is you need this card for the deck to function. Yeah. <laughs> so we're gonna activate the effect. Uh, grab a mana, and then I'm assuming we're gonna okay. activate mana effect in hand. Yep. Summon itself by sending, sending two. two. Yep. Yep. From and we got double Wait, whoa, whoa, got... whoa, whoa, whoa. What? Yeah. At least not from deck. Uh, because of uh, the field spell. Oh, okay, never mind. Monster yeah. for your hand. And then because they send a water and an earth, I think they have uh, battling targeting protection. Uh, yes, they have. Cannot be disturbed by battle, cannot be disturbed yeah, yeah, by yeah. effects. Okay. Yeah. Um, hmm. That's pretty good against. Uh... Against Starry yeah. Knights? Yeah, it's not bad. Uh, they're yeah. going to normal summon the uh, Malo, Malo effect. Uh, once per turn, you can send an element it's save fine. from your hand or graveyard. Uh, send an element. To, yeah. So. To bin an element. So now just bin another two. Uh, and then search one. Oh, yeah, you search one, I think. Was it the. Oh, okay. Did you do that? Yeah, they've been two. Was they've this been once two. per turn? Once per turn, if an element nope. saver from your hand or field would send a card from the hand to the graveyard, you can send. Oh, it is, a it is only once per turn. Okay. They cheated. So that's, okay. that's, a, that's a little bit of a minor cheat, but we'll see how much it. it All right, we'll, we'll see how much it matters. They are going to set a card. They have the element training. What does this card do? Uh, once per turn, oh, that's good. your opponent can target Palace of the Element to the Lords to control the card mm -hmm. effects. Also, cannot be destroyed by card effects. Once per turn, you contribute one monster, especially someone element saver from your deck with a different original attribute than that monster. Send this face-up card to the graveyard. You can send this face-up card to the graveyard, discard your entire hand, add an elemental lord monster from your uh, graveyard to your hand, equal to the number of cards you discarded. I mean, it's pretty good. Let's see what happens. All right, so we're going to activate the Starry right. Night to Starry Sky. Let's let you add either the Starry Knight or the uh, level 7 Light Dragon. Normal mm -hmm. Summon Witch. Uh, effect. Uh, okay, I think we're doing this a little bit wrong. Uh, oh, no, we... Uh, well, this can't chain. Uh, neither of these can yeah, run no, chain. I think they are just declaring. They're just, like, like shortcutting it a little bit. Yeah, All right, we're going to grab yeah. Droplet. Okay. I mean, we are grabbing the, the best one. That does that does out mana. I will say. Uh, yeah, it does out mana. Did we not add off of the, the sky? Did I miss that? Wait, what are you talking about? You can almost... Oh, yeah. this. You, it lets oh, you he's during your, if a face up level seven, you control. Yeah, this doesn't add anything. What are you talking about? During your main phase, you can normal summon a starry night level. Oh, okay, I thought this said add. I don't know why. In addition no. to the normal. Yeah, during your, if helps. Okay, yeah. All right, so they're gonna normal real real effect to add ceremony. Um, gonna activate the ceremony, ceremony, uh, and then activate balefire as starry night monster level seven light dragon for your deck to hand. Uh, then if you control no monsters and your opponent controls a dark monster, which they don't, uh, you can special summon it. <laughs> so a little bit la uh, bad. Yeah, they're going to add the Orb Beetle here. Uh, here they're going to activate the training, I guess, just hoping yeah. to protect stuff. Uh, they're going to cycle out the Mallow for a dark. I'm not even going to attempt mm -hmm. to pronounce that name. Yeah. Um, they're going to activate Ceremony because they summon to summon the dragon. Uh, dragon effect is going to target the monster. and No, no, I think they're going to... Okay, they're, okay, they're going to try and target the mana, but they... The level six, sorry. Um, but they can't... It can't be destroyed, so it doesn't matter that they targeted it. Oh, okay, so... Oh, they forgot. Yeah, they that's, forgot. that's 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 a minor... Um, sorry, I had a response. Yeah, wait... Uh, if, if they're gonna droplet it here, then, oh, yeah, then yeah. it didn't matter. Oh, they're okay, you they're droplet to start both cards. Yeah, you, you have to just you have to droplet both there. Yeah. Um, but they do have a double or nothing in in yeah. uh, in hand. Oh, so also the, the thing getting destroyed doesn't matter as long as you didn't get book, you won. Yeah. Uh. Okay. So yeah. they're just going Utopia. Uh, what? Uh. Yeah. I'm a little. Okay, yeah. So actually, that... Utopia double into the nine fifty like they won. <laughs> 
No, no, no. That that's not. That's just not how that works. <laughs> yeah. Right. Just, Hang I, on. Hover over double. Uh, yeah, because you have to search double or nothing, then special summon. Oh. Yeah. That that's why uh -oh. that's why the com that's why the combo doesn't work if you open double or nothing. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you can I still see. use double or nothing to double the attack, but you can't it, summon the Utopia. Yeah. Mm. Well, you can summon the Utopia normally, right? Yeah, Wait, but the you thing just, is, it like, would be you 5k, you don't want the OTK. So actually, hang on. So, because if you do that, Utopia comes 5k, 5k over 950, that's 41 plus 25. That's, like, close to killing them anyway. Yeah. Uh, this was a miss. Yeah, this is, this was a cheat. Oh, man. Yeah, yeah. This, this was a pretty big one. Uh -oh. um, yeah. This uh -oh. is one that, that did matter. Um, yeah. So let, let's let's Oops. try and talk through how things needed to be changed. So um, mm -hmm. Element Seder, had they had the attributes in Grave where they couldn't be destroyed by card effects. Mm -hmm. um, so, oh, yeah. So Starry Knight would have had to banish it and then attack again. Uh, Starry Knight doesn't wait, can I banish. Wait, can I restart? Oh. Wait, what? Which one? Uh, starting at Starry Dragon. This is they use this uh, effect. Target card on the field, destroy it. Uh, yeah. It's normal special, which wouldn't have worked. Yeah, yeah, you'd have to. Yeah, you'd have to like. Um, yeah, so you'd have, like, you'd have to like, drop it and then summon yeah. that. Yeah, you drop it, discard both, and then to pop it, right? Yeah, you drop it. And then what you do is you do uh, the Utopia at five k. No, the Utopia at two fifty into the nine fifty. Starry Knight attack into the uh four into the other one. That's twelve, and then start banish it. And then hit directly for twenty five. So let's see. So in that scenario, right, they have to drop, yeah. let's send the condemned witch and the probably the Starry Knight Sky yeah. uh, from field to negate both. So that way you yeah. can destroy it. Um, mm -hmm. And then you hard make Utopia. Utopia double into nine fifty. That's uh, yeah. forty one fifty, and yeah. then twenty five direct. Um, yeah, that's it's still not a lethal. It's push. not lethal, but it is up. It, it's pretty close. Yeah, like you can get close to killing them, but like you're, just, you're not dead. So it kind of yeah. at that point just kind of comes down to like what how like like element savers like crack back. Yeah, yeah. it would have been it would have been down to like what the top decks is, and unfortunately we don't know that. Um, yeah. yeah, I think the unless they like yeah they just they're leaving the duel. Yeah. Um, so yeah, mm -hmm. it it's kind of hard that's to say. Kind of, yeah, it, that's kind of big. And this is the this is just what happens when you have much newer players uh, mm -hmm. playing decks. Um, you know, it, yeah, it happens. They don't like. They don't notice these things. Like, yeah, it happens. Mm -hmm. it's normal. YouTube mm -hmm. commenters, I I see you in there. I see you <laughs> writing your YouTube comment. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> these are new you were, players. YouTube They're comment. Learning. YouTube having... comment. Just just flash back to like when you went to like your first locals with like your rocket structure deck, and you kept trying to like, you kept trying to like cheat with like four load furious dragon. Like, <laughs> yeah. I, I know, I know the mind of a, <laughs> of a oh, YouTube commenter. <laughs> mm. But yeah, all right, so that game two did kind of matter, that game one did not. Uh, yeah. Game one was just a curb stomp. <laughs> yeah. This was, yeah, this was so, a pretty... Uh, mm -hmm. I, I, and what, they have, okay, they have an elemental lord in their, in their hand. They do mm -hmm. have enough names to summon yeah. it they summon it but what are we what are, the light looks the bad one isn't it or is it just oh it's just right geki yeah. oh that one would have kind of mattered yeah it probably matter yeah wait how many cards do they have in grave by the way would they have had in grave uh one uh, two three i don't four, think they, a lot i don't think they could have because don't you need exactly five yeah but or i think like, all you could change, change it you can change attributes. the attributes to light and then change the other ones to something else yeah, so you, oh. you have two lights already, and even if these are once per turn, you have three individuals. So yeah, okay, never mind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So it didn't matter actually. It did matter a little bit, but mm -hmm. it, it does come down to like even if we didn't do that, we still had a game mm -hmm. three where the uh, the Star Knight yeah, player went first, first, and if mm -hmm. they managed to do the yeah, uh, like barrier statue, there's stuff just like again. yeah, there's just like a lot of there's just like a lot of like what ifs. There's a lot yeah, of variables yeah, too many what ifs who would have gone. So it is what it is. Right. Um, but that is all from us. If you guys enjoyed. Uh, you know, be sure to leave a like. If you really enjoyed, make sure to subscribe. Uh, tell us what you think. Uh, how, have you ever had anything like this happen to you? I'm sure you have. Uh, but yeah. to, yes. make sure to comment and tell me just exactly how upset you are that uh, we didn't step in uh, post hence and say, hey, you guys need to replay this game uh, because we mm -hmm. can't show cheating and, and yeah. new players not understand the game. Please comment yes. and tell me about yeah. that. Cause I really not because, do not because we're this. not because we're going to do that, but because of the algorithm. Bye. Yes, exactly. <laughs> See you later. Catch you later. Peace.